This is Shilika for Medico Awesome. Uh, this is the immunohistochemistry in the cytogenetic series. In the last video, we discussed about ALL, B cell, T cell, and the loss of function, gain of function mutation genes, translocation T21 associated with good prognosis, and the AML, the cytogenetics, the CD markers involved, and the different types of AML and the translocations involved. Also, uh, the stains used in AML and treatment roughly. So, now proceeding with the next part of the video. After the ALL and the AML comes our beloved CML. And there is no need for a mnemonic for it. Everybody knows that the CML is translocation 922. That is Philadelphia chromosome. Uh, the next comes is CLL and for this you will have to take a little effort and remember that C will remind you of 3 and you can think of 13Q deletion. So CLL most commonly the, trans, uh, the immunohistochemistry involved is C uh, 13 Q deletion okay and it is the commonest and it is also associated with good prognosis so here the trick to remember is that 13 usually is unlucky but in case of CLL it turns lucky so, it is associated with good prognosis. Alright. After CML, uh, CLL, okay. One more thing in CLL is um, LL are sort of like LLs. Okay. So, also it, uh, the translocation, another translocation is 11Q and um, trisomy 12Q. And another one is deletion 17P. So these three have poor prognosis. Also uh, you can remember that uh, the treatment for uh, CLL is um, C H like L. O R A M B U C I L. So C L L that is chlorambucil. But but the drug of choice for treatment of C L L is fludarabine. So this is about C M L and C L L. There is another. Um, condition called as myelodysplastic syndrome so I kind of have a bad handwriting and I write MDS like this it is myelodysplastic syndrome so this part of the M is like someone written in a bad handwriting and this 7 so it's associated with monosomy 7 and this S will remind you of deletion 5Q. So uh, M, M will remind you of monosomy 7 and uh, this S will remind you of deletion 5Q. So deletion 5Q is the most frequent change and uh, it is also the change in adults and monosomy 7 is the most frequent in children then uh, this is about the CML, CLL and the MDS the myelodysplastic syndrome watch out for ne next video coming up for NHLs that is non-Hodgkin's lymphoma thank you stay awesome